remember when we were kids and saw sci-fi movies about the future? Space travel. Mars. What a magnificent sight. Horse fields. Picture phones. Robot maids. Ray guns and other super weapons. Remember all that cool futuristic stuff? What happened? When's the future going to get here? Well, my friends, it's already here, and we're going to prove it to you. Most of these gadgets and inventions already exist, or they're on their way. Where's the future? Hey, I got your future right here. Each segment of our show starts with a clip from a sci-fi flick. Welcome to Futurama 2. Welcome to a journey into the future. Then, we cut the latest footage of the real state of the art for each invention. Heat, is that safe? The risk, I say try it. How about anti-gravity devices? We've been hearing about that for years. When's that going to happen? Well, guess what? It's here. You ready? <laughs> These are called lifters. Tin foil, some balsa wood, a few straws. Stuff my Uncle Larry used to bust out of prison. You can buy this stuff at the supermarket, and you can build your own anti-gravity device at home. I happen to have a super genius right here on set, Chris Zernel, and he is going to explain how these lifters work. Chris, what's the story? Well, it's something of a mystery. There is an effect called the D-field ground effect mm -hmm. that causes the lift, but the physical rules behind what's happening are still not understood. Ah, enough of that science stuff. Let's make this baby fly! Now, a lifter has no moving parts. You simply hook it up to a high voltage source, like a TV monitor, and attach strings to each corner to keep it from flying away. And... That's amazing! Look at that. Cue the UFO music. Okay, check it out. We're going to turn out the lights here, and you can see the corona discharge. Unbelievable. Anti-gravity, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. Now, another thing. Where are the ray guns we're supposed to have? And what about eating pills for meals? Well, how about science? The roast beef was a little bit tough. <laughs> yeah, right, pal. And where are cities going to look this cool? Personal transportation.